Good morning everybody, today we're going to talk about Niches. Niches is a pretty cool company that has developed a technology that can write full scripts for your YouTube videos. In this video we're going to talk about the technology and see if it's actually useful or not. Well, sort of, you see that opening paragraph was actually written by this AI website and I thought this is a really interesting development that could be very useful for anybody out there who's into blogging, e-commerce, any of these kind of areas where you need to come up with ideas and content. So let's take a quick look at the website and see if it's for you. So here's the website. It's got a very basic look split into ideas and content creation and search and reports. Product seems to have been added recently. I don't remember that being there. So it looks like it's been actively developed to add new features and functions. I simply clicked on the YouTube tool. You can select the kind of things you want to be generated. You're not always going to want all of these generated, um, but just for the sake of demonstration, I'll add them all. It's then a simple matter of filling out a form. In this case, channel name, category, Agree what the channel's about, search keywords, and the title of the video. None of the forms are especially long, they'll only take you a minute to fill out, and then you simply click the generate button at the bottom. You'll then need to wait, it takes less than 60 seconds, and you will be emailed a notification, which is a bit annoying. I'm hoping they'll add a setting to turn that off. Once the content's been generated, you simply refresh the page, and there's a button that says view plan. So here we go, let's refresh the page. It says generating plan at the moment, hit refresh view plan and there's all the content so this is very quickly generated uh, the keywords now these aren't always going to be correct certainly not in this case but here's the interesting one the YouTube opening line so this top one was a pretty good opening line but you might recognize this second opening line good morning everybody today we're going to talk about and so on and so forth that's the one I actually use now you can edit it and tweak it and make it your own you don't have to use it word for word and that's what this is really good for is coming up with ideas and suggestions that you can then use yourself for YouTube it can even come up with a video outline giving you ideas on how you should structure your video so what is AI how does AI work etc etc as well as content, this can also be useful to help guide you in your path as to what you want to do next. It's got these business idea quizzes. I filled one of these out before and actually it was, again, it was super quick as you saw. If we just scroll down, you can see all the content I've been messing around with in the content section and then you can go to business ideas. So all I had to do was fill out what I was interested in. In this case, I was doing this with someone else. I like helping young people with career planning that's all we put in and you tick what kind of areas you might be interested in so type that in tick whether it's Amazon courses and then it generates all of these different ideas now again some are a bit hit and miss it's not 100% gold but where it comes up with a great idea I think it does a really good job considering it takes less than 60 seconds so a book where you interview successful people in different fields and analyze those careers and give advice to the reader is a really great idea similarly you've got courses about how to get the good job and how to find a career they like all this just from one sentence I find this really impressive really interesting what the technology can do and again these are suggestions these are to try and help spark your own thought process and help you get past maybe a writer's block or if you're just not sure where to go you might have thought well I might want a podcast but what do I do it on and this might help you define that subject to further help your research down the bottom is a Google Trends section so if you're not familiar with Google Trends you can have a little look at what's been trending on Google over the last few years and that may help you decide to write a blog article or do a video on it because it has been popular so here we pop in career guidance when you click save it will pull in the Google Trends graph giving you a five-year view of how popular the topic is it's a really cool extra little feature that comes in handy for research. A feature that seems to have popped up overnight is the ability to produce product details. So again, you simply fill out a simple form and this allows you to generate product descriptions. You can see these forms, there's not really much to them. It takes less than a minute to fill out what you're interested in. So we'll use this website as an example and then you simply hit generate. Again, it will come up with a range of suggestions for you. Some work better than others. I think it's a great way to get a starter for 10 that you can then refine into your ideal description. 
And talking of refinement, there's an interesting little trick you might want to try when using this. So let's say you're writing a blog article. Again, you want the intro and the outline, so you can select both those, fill out the form and hit generate. This will get you the usual suggestions, so the blog post intro and the outline. Now the intro gives you a paragraph, but what if you want a little bit more? Well, it can't do the full article, but if you add an extra intro, leave all that information the same if you want, you can adjust it and then just change the title of the post. It will now go and generate a new intro. So if this article is about Pilates and how you would track the ongoing benefits of Pilates, we've got our intro. Uh, the first two intros we're now generating a second one based on a slight variation to get a bit more text and this can give you you know 500 to a thousand words if you do this around, across a range of subjects which is a great start to a blog article all of this content can be easily edited so you can copy it and take it elsewhere or if you just want to store it in the website for later use simply click the little edit button make the change you want to change and hit save and it will be there for later use if you're interested in this i bagged this from appsumo for a one-off cost of 59 dollars which is less than 40 pounds and i have to say it's a really great deal because a lot of these kind of services and I've used a few charge you per generation of ideas this particular one has unlimited ideas so you can go ahead and generate as much content as you like a lot of people have been given this very good feedback now this isn't on the main AppSumo page this is in their marketplace and I'm quite surprised because this is much better than some of the recent main deals that they've been pushing so if you're interested in this I'd appreciate it if you click my affiliate link in the video description below I hope you found this little video useful thanks for watching.